Candace, I'm going to ask you a very important question. What does it mean to have another woman represent you visually to become the face of, possibly the voice of, when you're not there? What does it mean for Kirsten to stand in your place as the Cuoco brand? You know, um, I think I'm going to spin it in a sense of how I feel about her as a woman, as a young woman, right? So she, you're, she's 20, she's not even 21 yet, and I'm 25, and I see a lot of myself in her, right? So it was a, it was almost like a direct reflection of myself, but in the sense of everything that, um, how do you say it? Everything that you, that I wish that I would have done at that young age, which yeah. is, it's, it's true. I mean, um, I mean, when we first met, like, like she said earlier, you know, we didn't really, really, um, connect right yeah. away. Right. But she's so strong. She has such a strong personality and I have such a strong personality that we were both individuals on our own. Yeah. And I think we recognized that. Uh, and Kirsten, you know, she's got her head screwed on so straight. I mean, anything and everything that you probably wish your kid, daughter, sister, mother would be, right? Like anything that you would want a woman to represent, that's what she is. I mean, she, you know, she's got her shit together in school more than anybody else I know. She still takes care of herself. Okay, she's a good friend, um, badass girlfriend. Uh, she's just, she's a good, a good kid with her dad. I mean, you know what I mean? Like, she just, she represents everything. And I have a daughter. My daughter's seven. And it's, if my kid grows up to be like her, which, you know, you know, it's just, it's, um, she's a direct reflection of, of what I, what I value in a woman. Right? Strength. Yeah. That's, that's fantastic. And Kirsten, what she's saying to you right now, I'm sure that that's a huge responsibility for you. And how do you take that? Do you uphold okay, that? And You know, I mean, thinking of the, of the fact that being the face of the label, you know, you really represent something and you have to uphold that. But I think, you know, the reason why she chose me in the first place is because it comes naturally. And, you know, in this industry, in any industry, a lot of people, you know, put on a face or fake and, you know, fake it until you make it. And we are just so real with we each other. Yeah, you know, we live, eat, and breathe what Kuoko means. So, you know, I don't have to stress about trying to be something else. I don't have to worry about, you know, should I dye my hair this or should I, you know, leave it like this or you lose 10 pounds, anything like that. You know, I'm so confident in the fact that it's just who we are, you know, and it's, and I don't think it's going to change that. And it comes naturally for both of us. So as this label grows, and elevates to a really high luxury brand. Are you prepared to live this, um, the face to Cuoco 24-7 and represent in, in the best possible way? Honestly, I mean, like I said, it's not what I'm helping her with. It's what she's helping me with. And, you know, it's a privilege for me to be here. She's done so fucking much for me. And in this fashion industry, she's pulled me here. She's pulled me here. Let's go to New York. Let's go to London. And, you know... I'm behind her 110% and it's just, you know, I want to stay that way. I'm going to help her with, you know, anything that she ever needs because I know that she'd do the same for me. And, you know, if I ever start my own label or design clothes or do whatever, when, 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 when I start my when own I, label, when I start my own label when, which she will, we will, you know, summer be able to go together. We will be able to grow together. And she, I know that she'd help me the same way as I helped her. She's gonna be fucking thrown in chains and bending over backwards for me because I know she would. That's why I do I'm gonna be right. better start yoga. <laughs> better start doing yoga. yoga. No, you know what? Um, it really is like a collective creative energy that that we have. I mean, I respect her as a woman. Not, and it's not just about her looks. It really is about who she is. I mean, she's really, she's a badass friend. You know what I mean? And and just her in a sense of being a woman and how she holds and carries herself throughout the day, how she represents herself when she's around men, other women, younger, younger girls. I mean, it's just, it's everything that my label 
represents. And it's always, always, always going to be about women with strength. And I mean, and she, just like she said, I live, I live, eat, and breathe it. She fucking lives. So what I'm hearing she is... She sleeps with this shit. Right. You eat it. You are it. It's just... Get in there, girl. Get in there. I think what I just heard was, this is a match made in Coco heaven. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. just, Perfect. Thank you so much.